Hello, in this course, we are going to learn Unreal Engine 5.1 and some of the basics. First, we are going to see how to download Unreal Engine. So in order to download Unreal Engine 5, first we need to go to epicgames.com. First, we have to download Epic Launcher. So click on this download and just set your location where you want. So just uh, install the software. So I have already installed Epic Games Launcher. So I will directly open this Epic Games. So after you install, whenever you open the Epic Games, you will get this window. So after you install Epic Games, uh, if you want to download Unreal Engine 5, we have to click on this Unreal Engine. And here you have to select the versions which you want to install. Here at present, I have already uh, installed Unreal Engine 5. So you have to click on this and click on download. So once you download Unreal Engine 5, we have to go to the library so that here you can see whatever the versions you have installed. At present, I have installed only 5.0. So here it's showing only 5.0.3. Now, if you want to create a project first, we have to click on this launch button. It takes some time for loading. It depends on your system configuration. So after opening Unreal Engine here, you can see it will open an Unreal project browser where you can see the recent project which you have done. And there are some templates here in the left side, how to create the games like first person shooter like third person shooter and there is an vehicle templates too and we can do some cinematic videos which is related to the movies and we can do some vfx shots and there is some other templates which is related to the architecture so in this course i'm going to select the games and here you can see there are some options like first person and third person top down so what the thing is whenever you select this it will load with a default templates which is related to the first person either like third person so for this course, I'm going to select the blank project because as this is a beginner course, so we will start the projects by using the blank projects. So from blank projects, actually we can create the first person, third person and top down, whatever the templates you're going to see here. So we'll start with the blank project. So right side, you can see some of the settings here. Here you can see like blueprints and C++. So suppose if you're not from the programming background, you can select here the blueprint. So later on courses, I will explain about the blueprint and C++, what we can do. Even we can create the games without uh, using the programming language, like we can use a blueprint. So the target platform. So if you want to create the games for the PC, here you have to select the desktop. Suppose if you're going to make the games for the mobile, here you can select the mobile. So by default, I will select this desktop. And here the quality at present i will put it to maximum and by default for you when you open the unreal engine actually uh, the starter content will be enabled so as we want to start the blank project i don't want to include any starter contents for time being i will just uncheck this starter content option and here you can give the name of the project so for example this is an like introduction so i will give introduction and also remember one thing here when you're giving the project name here we cannot give the spaces or any other special characters and here you have to select the project location okay so you have to click on this and you have to set the location so for time being i will put onto the like my default drive and just click on create so here's the default level which unreal engine opens with the default sky and some of the lights in the environment so in the next video i'm going to explain how to navigate around the levels and some of the basic options